Good morning, time for Eleventers. How careful are we with the words that we use? Can words be misplaced? The Bible speaks of language being very powerful. God's word was spoken and things came into being. Jesus is called the Logos, the Greek word for word. The words that we use can cut and hurt or build up and encourage. There are profanities, things that are profane, using God's name in vain, for example, which is different from vulgarity, speaking of people's body parts in various ways, you know, vulgar language that kids always giggle at, that make us chuckle behind our, our hands. We shouldn't have said that. But there's a difference between vulgarity, profanity, and also kind, gentle words. The use of language and wit. Uh, the old joke, you know, about hedgehogs. Why do they do that? A play on words. Roadhogs, hedgehogs, all that sort of stuff. How we treat creation. How we speak of it. Being stewards of the earth. I mention hedgehogs because I'm a big fan of nature. Little creatures that we are watching disappear before our eyes. When did you last see a hedgehog? Anyway, use the words that come out of your mouth carefully. I try to, and when we say something we shouldn't, then we need to apologise. That's hard as well, to apologise, to say sorry. Our tongues are very powerful things. Anyway, enjoy your weekend. However you use your words, shouting, quietly, whispering, exuberantly, Thoughtfully, may they not be vulgar nor profane. Take care. Bye-bye.